Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord. You're welcome to Thursday, the 8th day of December, 2022. Our topic today is passion, a key to destiny fulfillment. The Bible says also, he built towers in the desert and digged many wells, for he had much cattle, both in the low country and in the plains. He had husbandmen also and vine dressers in the mountains and in Carmel, for he loved husbandry. First Chronicles chapter 26 verse 10. Thought for the day, when you find what you love doing, you would be so eager and excited to do it, even without a pay. Some time ago, God's servant was invited for a meeting in South Africa, and we had to pay our way to and fro, even though he was not given any honorarium or package by those who invited him. He was not bothered. He wasn't bothered because he had one fundamental understanding and that is that the person who invited him for the program was not his pair. His pair is God Almighty because he is working for God and if he does his job well, he will pay, God will pay him well anywhere in the world. He had also traveled to a country in Europe to preach and again we paid our fare all the way to and fro without an honorarium. And again, he wasn't bothered. We were not bothered because he loves what he was doing. This is how it's supposed to be in every other area of your life, where you find what God wants you to do. When you find what you love doing, you will be so eager and excited to do it, even without a pay, even without any remuneration. Those who live for money end up mourning in dissatisfaction and in disappointment. So don't live for money. Money-centered decisions are the most useless decisions on the face of the earth. There are people who married the wrong people because those who seem to have money. Money consideration was the strongest factor. There are people working in wrong places because of money consideration. When you make decisions based on money, 99% of your decisions would be very wrong. So beloved, determine to make decisions that are based on meaning instead of money. You will all miss it in the name of Jesus Christ. Remember this, that when you find what you love doing, you would be so eager and excited to do it, even without a pay. Praise God. What's our assignment today? Number one, discover what you are passionate about, what you love doing, if possible, without pay, then do it. Number two, be driven by the quest to make a meaning more than making money. Praise the Lord. Let's pray. Say, Lord, I thank you that you ignite my passion, both for you and for what I'm living for. Give me the grace to make meanings in my lifetime oh god in jesus name praise god i'm excited i'm excited and i'm very glad that you are making up your mind to live a life on purpose praise the lord if you are not yet born again jesus is not yet the lord of your life there is hardly anything you do that can really please the Lord. But today you want to say, Pastor, pray for me. I want to be born again. I want Jesus to be the Lord of my life. Simply pray this after me. Say, Lord Jesus, thank you for dying for my sins. Please come into my life. Be the Lord of my life. Wash away all my sins. Make me a new person. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want to wish you a happy birthday before I close. It's your birthday today. As your day is so shall your strength be. God causes his face to shine on you and be gracious unto you in Jesus' name. You have yourself a wonderful day. 
Don't forget to read your Bible. We're in 2 Thessalonians chapter 2 all the way to 1 Timothy chapter 1. Praise the Lord. God bless you. Have a wonderful day.